It's just Iron Man stuff, yeah. Okay. Uh, well, in the RMA space, um, you know, the government has recently announced um, a new set of reforms that it's got cross-party support for, generally. Um, we, though, however, have already started a piece of work that's really a blue skies piece of work looking at the RMA. Right. So since Simon Upton first brought it in, what, what was trying to be achieved? Has it been achieved? Yeah. Uh, could we do things differently? Yeah. And we've got parties right, ac right across the, the, the sector uh, in a work group looking at that. From, from the environmental side, from the business side, uh, with local government New Zealand trying to say actually just have a first principles review, look at the RMA, is it working? And I'm, we're pretty excited about that and we expect uh, by the middle of next year we'll have some, some outcomes from that. Well I think the new thing we're doing is actually initiating these conversations ourselves. So we're not waiting for somebody to say this yes. needs to be done. Understood. We're actually taking the lead, showing the leadership and yes. saying and bringing partners in. Yes. And the people we're asking are loving it. They're loving being part of the conversation, yes. putting their ideas on the table in a non-confrontational way. And I think we're, we're likely to get the best outcomes in that sort of mechanism and, and I'm tremendously encouraged yes. by the willingness of people to participate. Well, I think climate change uh, is absolutely on our radar now. Uh, people that talked about climate change 10 years ago were 10 years ahead of their time. The time now is really um, for us to step up, uh, particularly in the adaption space. I, uh, we can show some leadership roles um, in emissions reduction, but in the adaption space, we need to actually front this issue. And I think local government can do that uh, with its communities in a way that central government can't. And I think there is, there is widespread community support now who people realise that climate change is here, yes. it's real, yes. it will have significant impacts. And while you know we talk about what's going to happen in a hundred years, yes. um, the sooner we start thinking and making some of these calls, yes. the better able we're going to be able to adapt. And I think that is an absolute leadership role uh, for local government New Zealand, for mayors and councillors in New Zealand. So it's fundamental, fundamental. I mean, politicians come and go every three year cycle. The communities are left there and I think communities now are more mature in their view that actually we've got to have some long term principles and processes in place. You cannot leave climate change uh, to the whim of an electoral cycle. It's not going away, it's happening. So the sooner people can engage and understand the significance of it, the less political it will actually become and people realise this is the right direction to follow, particularly in the adaption space. And there are major decisions to be made in that. Um, where things are located, where housing is, where infrastructure is, um, you know, they're all significant decisions. But we have no option. Uh, they have to be faced up to, and I, I'm pretty keen to lead a sector that actually takes the lead.